thing that scares me the most is the potential that I may not finish it. I like to put my mind to something and do it, and failure scares me, so I'm scared I won't make it. So the thing I'm excited for the most is probably the camaraderie, having eight of my best mates, running together, sleep deprived together, in a real uncomfortable position for two days. Three down. We're about to run our fourth one in half an hour. I'm feeling good, the night ones are a bit tough, but I'm excited, the sun's out. Done Moab yet? Yeah. 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 Nice, Rochi! Nice, Rochi! That was hard. That was hot. It's only going to get hotter, I think. Did you do the one last night? The legs are tightening up a bit. It's alright though. Yeah. We've only got eight to go. Oh, yeah. The, the heart and everything's alright. The lungs feeling good. The calves. My toes hurting, my knees hurting. Why did Pat get me to do this? Um, I decided to do this with Paddy um, a few years ago. He came up with something or heard something online that um, once a year you should do something that you don't think you'll finish. And I kind of just thought, oh well, I'm locked in with Paddy. I'm doing that with him for however long he does it for. So he's just strong. Um, and yeah, you could say strong or disciplined. Um, same thing physically and mentally. Gets up same time every morning, trains. Um, he was sick before this and still still did it. Um, yeah, just if he's got something in his mind, he's, he's going to get it done no matter what. Hello, Ricky. How are you? <laughs> did you? What's wrong with you? Yeah, fair. Um, it's a pretty hard thing to do, not everyone can do it, so I don't know any of it helps when you're struggling. Tilt it, yeah! It's been really cool to see the community get behind it and kind of jump in and get involved with us. And They're not doing 12 runs, they might do one or two or six, right? But they can still help, and it, and it does help. And, you know, there's times when we might not show it, because we've had an hour of sleep and we're running at midnight or something like that. But we do love it. Lap five, and it's hotter than you think. Ah, it was a good one though. I used to run with cars, so that was a punish. Other than that, body? Ah, uh, seven out of ten. Good. My fucking hammies are hurt. <clears throat> Trying to keep them under four minute Ks. Um, yeah, getting tougher and tougher to do it. <laughs> yeah, what did you do? What did you do just now? Uh, three fifty twos, I think. So. Just trying to keep it rapid, but the legs are hurting. <laughs> I could vomit. If I stuck my fingers down my throat, I'd vomit. Yeah. I wish it rained though. These things? Yeah, yeah. Oh, absolutely. For like times like now, I would have tried to find one. I've always, like, you know, come into the gym and go, oh, I should get on it. 
know, yeah. you just have to go, yeah. and now I have a mic, you know. They're good. Summer, I got you. I feel nice. A sugar and spice. I want to thank you all for coming. I came up with this stupid idea with Tommy a couple of months ago, thinking it might just be us two. And you boys have all jumped in, and I'll tell you what, you've made it. You've made the weekend, so we've just needed it. <laughs> we've, yeah, we've absolutely <laughs> needed it. There's a lot of people that have dropped out, but you boys haven't. Um, second of all, most important, yeah, we'll make change for them. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> second of all, oh, and, um, and most importantly, um, a few of you young boys might not realise, you might not have experienced it before, but I've been around the, the traps. So I have experienced it. There's, there's times like these that when you're in the middle of it, you don't know until it's over. And then when it's over, you look back and you think, it's one of the best times of my life. And I'm gonna give you boys a hot tip right now. We're in, it. We're yes. in the best time. Yes. We're, in We're in the best time of our life. We're gonna look back on this like in years to come and just think, how good was that? And if you're not gonna be able to recreate it, because it's it just happens, but we're in it right now, boys. So I know we're all hurting, no more so than me. <laughs> but lads, we've got two runs left. Let's fucking enjoy it. Yeah! Yeah! There's a few times where that fear was popping right up in front of me when we were on the sixth run, not even halfway through, and my legs just did not work. And I was thinking, there's still seven runs to go and they're only getting worse. And that fear was there, but I've read a lot of books about some amazing things that people have done. And a common theme is just take the next step. Just take the next step. You can build things up in front of you and they can be enormous mountains, but all you need to do is take the next step. You don't have to climb a mountain all in one go. If you can take the next step, you can keep going. Here we go, lads. Oh, I didn't think we'd make it this far, boys. Here we are. 48 hours later. Eh? I just wanted to see you again. Solid. Solid. Great. That's unbelievable. You did it, man. Just everyone, just everyone here. Just what Reborn has created. Just everyone.